Hello all, welcome to part 46 of SNG training series. In this session, I am going to explain and practically demonstrate when parallel is equal to test is provided at the test tag level instead of the suit tag level. So the thing here is this parallel is equal to test will only work when it is provided at the suit tag level. But when you provide the parallel is equal to test, at the test tag level in the test change XML file, it doesn't work. Okay. Instead, sequential execution of the test will happen. All these things I'm going to show you practically now. So parallel is equal to test can only be mentioned at the suit tag level in test change XML file. And we should not be providing that in the test tag level. It will not be giving you any error, but it doesn't work. As you already know about parallel is equal to test. Okay, the working of the parallel is equal to test uh, in test and parallel execution from the previous session. Okay, as you already know, uh, the test tags in the test and XML files. Okay, here we have three test tags test tag one, test tag two, test tag three. So when you mention parallel is equal to test here, and you just mention the thread count, let's say thread count is equal to three here, what happens is all these three tests will be running in parallel here tests are being parallelly executed but what if you move this particular thing to the test tag level does it make any sense here this particular test tag has any other test tags in inside it no there are classes inside this there are methods inside it how can you run test parallel where there is only one test does it make any sense when you provide parallel is equal to test here it doesn't make any sense okay neither it will not give you any error guys you are allowed to provide, but it doesn't give you any error. But if you run this, all the tests will run in a sequential manner, uh, manner. Even one thread will be allocated, guys, okay? So because parallel is enabled at the test tag level, and you are you are giving this attribute at a particular test instead of suit level. So this attribute will be disabled. When it is disabled, indirectly disabled, right? Because this need to be provided at the suit tag level so that this particular test which are inside the suit will run parallelly. Okay, when one of the tests from this is running, another test parallelly will be running like that. That is the purpose of the parallel is equal test. But here it is provided at one of the test tag level because of which it is indirectly saying that parallel is disabled. Parallel execution is disabled, guys, because only one test, how can it run it parallelly, guys? Okay, only one test is there. How can a one test run parallelly? That doesn't make sense. So, thread will be one. All the methods, test methods will be running on a single thread in a sequential fashion one by one as you can see if i run this when the this parallel is equal to test is provided test tag level you see only one thread is allocated and all the tests are running in a sequential fashion one by one after register login then search that is the problem but if you provide the same parallel is equal to test thread count is equal to three at the suit level then it is going to work then you will be seeing that this test will run on one of the thread this test uh, uh, numbers will run on one of the tests one of the uh, thread this test group members like the test methods will run on one of the tests, or one of the thread. Okay, so that's where parallel is equal test should be specified, guys. At suit tag level, suit tag level, but not at the test tag level. You see, now the threads different threads. This thread is running on thread 20. Search is running on 22. Login related test method is running on 21. Okay, login is working on 21. 20 means register. Search is 22. You see, you can see that. Okay, parallel execution is enabled only in this case, but parallel is equal to test. This particular, if you put at the test tag level, that doesn't make sense. And it is equally important, equally same as uh, sequential execution because a single test cannot be made parallel, okay? Using parallel is equal to test. So hope guys, you understood why parallel is equal to test need to be specified at the suit tag level, okay? Instead of providing at the test tag level, which where it doesn't work and uh, it is indirectly or directly same as sequential execution. If you provide at the test tag level, only parallel execution, it will work as parallel execution only when specified at the suit tag level. So that's all for this session, guys. In the next session, I'm going to cover another testing topic for you. Till then, see you. Bye-bye.